Hi, I'm Joe from 1031 and I'm here with Billy today and we're going to do a little demonstration on how to make a scarecrow. Um, this is our scarecrow that we do at 1031 but we're going to do a simplified version of it so that you could possibly replicate this at home. So we're going to start with just a white powder. We use a, a white cake powder. This is a product that you can buy online, um, but you could go into any of the costume stores or party supply stores around this time, any of the Halloween pop-up stores, and get just a white makeup. And uh, these are just sponges that you buy at um, CVS. They're just makeup wedges. And uh, so we're just going to be putting the white powder all over. We're not going to get too close to the eyes, but when you're at home, you can get as close as you want. As far as the costume goes, you can really, um, you know, either go to Savers or uh, a, like a Salvation Army, or even if you have clothes at home that are like blue jeans, kind of like what he's wearing today, um, that you can use to uh, save a little money and make it all at home. So we use a, a yellowish color here which if you can't find this particular color, I mean, you could look and see if there's any sort of even eyeshadows in, uh, similar to this color. Um, but if you had to, you could even use a blush. And we're just gonna add a little of this color here. And you can see I'm coming into the eye a little bit, but I'm not going in too close. We'll just go uh, leave the bottom like that for now. So then um, we're going to use a, um, an orange uh, grease makeup, which is a lot like a lipstick. So you can really just use any kind of lipstick at home, or you can find this product or any of the, the liquid sort of face painting products similar that you might find in a tube. Sometimes they're compressed uh, in like little blister packages. And we're just going to start to do a little triangle nose. And it's good if you can get like a little chiseled brush like this. It's very easy to work with. So now we're going to do your lips. So just kind of keep your lips just like that. Going to just make sure those lips are dry. So for the eyebrows, we're using a brown. And you can use either a powder or a liquid. And again, like I said, sometimes you see the, the colors that are just in a little blister package, and you can use those as well. So we're just going to start with kind of just getting a, a line across kind of following his, his natural um, eyebrow. And you can just kind of fill in a little bit of a triangle. And you can darken these in a little bit. And if, you know, they move a little bit, you can just make them a little bit bigger, even it out. Just color it in, going back and forth. So you can actually get like a shirt sleeve, uh, like a big old sweatshirt. And uh, you can cut it and then sew it in the inside. So the two um, parts together, simple seam right across. And then just cut out a little circle by putting it together like that. And just cutting out a circle like that. And this can cover the hair. <laughs> just be careful not to mess up the makeup. And then we could tuck this in to like a, a little flannel shirt like he has on today. You can get just some yarn that you might have around the, the house and you can just add that on with a simple tie. You can also buy uh, hula skirts that you can get at party stores and uh, simply just by cutting them it's an easy way to get that stuffed hay look without nearly making as much mess as using loose pieces. And you can just tie the two together and put that on to create the hair. And then typically, like I said, we would have a smaller hat, but this will give you an idea. And this will probably fit you just fine. And this is actually a store-bought hat. You can get this um, at any costume store. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick demonstration. Again, you know, you don't have to go all out. You can use a lot of stuff that you have at home or even uh, in the, you know, just store-bought. Um, and some crafty things at home um, that you might be able to find. So have fun and happy Halloween.